The Abby and Libby Memorial Park is officially open. News 18's Meredith Hackler went to the dedication and talked with family members of the girls. They say creating the park couldn't have been possible without the support from the community. Abigail Williams and Liberty German were murdered in February of 2017. While the case still remains unsolved, on Saturday, their lives were celebrated here at this park, which was built with love and support from the community. It's been a, a, a big labor of love and uh, it's finally come. Every, every part of this park is stuff that they loved. For the last four years, Abby and Libby's family members have been raising money to build the park. On Saturday, hundreds of people in the community came and showed their support. That support is what sparked the idea to create the park in the first place. After their murder, um, people were sending us money and everything, and, and I didn't want the money. I said, hey, let's, let's, let's try to do something nice. And uh, the money just kept coming. and, and I. So we thought, hey, let's just try to build them a ball field somewhere. And so we got with uh, Abby's family and said, hey, what, so let's just build a park. And building the park is something family members wanted to do to help keep the memory of their girls alive. And this is going to be a lasting legacy. Long after I'm gone, somebody's going to drive by and we're going to have signs. <laughs> Don't have them yet, but we're going to have signs and somebody's going to say, Abby and Libby Park, what, what's, what's that about? and then somebody's going to do some research. While the day is bittersweet for the families, they hope it will lead to that one tip that will crack the case. Two little girls gave, paid the ultimate price, and we still have somebody walking around that's uh, responsible for a double murder. You know, it's horrific. Um, I li we live it every day, every day. And uh, not that catching the person, will it's not going to bring them back, but it's a part of it that needs to be done. But those girls, as well as the community and family, we all deserve justice. I don't have the intricate details of the law enforcement, but I tell you, I believe that, that, that they have a plan. And so, as a grandpa, I just have to be patient. If you would like to donate to future projects here at the park, you can do so by visiting abbyandlibbymemorialpark.org. If you have a tip about the case, you're asked to call 844-459-5786. Reporting in Delphi, Meredith Hackler, News 18.